Hello friends, I'm Dr. Gulhima Arora, Senior Consultant Dermatologist and Director, Mehekta Gul Derma Clinic, New Delhi. So what is skin tanning? Skin tanning is nothing but an exaggerated darkening of your skin. It is a uniform darkening of the natural skin color by a shade or two. It generally occurs on the exposed parts of the skin which are either exposed to excessive ultraviolet radiation from the sunlight or any other source of UV rays. And why does it occur? Tanning is basically a defense of your skin's immunity. It occurs when the skin pigment cells called melanocytes rise to the surface of the skin on exposure to ultraviolet rays and protect the other cells of the skin. So the melanocytes rise up and behave like an umbrella shielding the other skin cells because if you tan for a long time or the tanning remains for a long time there are chances of other side effects of the ultraviolet ray setting in like uh, premature aging or even skin cancers so we are worried about that and hence it tanning is actually to be thought and looked uh, upon as as a natural defense mechanism okay so is tanning permanent tanning is not permanent definitely not it's a rather temporary uh, phenomenon that occurs unless you are repeatedly exposed to ultraviolet rays. And tanning usually occurs more on the exposed parts of the skin. And once the skin exfoliates or renews itself every three to four weeks, the tan automatically fades off or gets removed. So because our skin is in a constant state of renewal and if you do not expose yourself to further ultraviolet rays, there isn't too much chance that your tan is going to remain for a long time. And what are the treatments you suggest for tanning? Well, I would say prevention is better than cure in this case. One must aim at trying to prevent a skin tan in the first place if you don't like it because there are certain people who indulge in artificial tanning like the westerners want an artificial tan and they indulge in it by the use of tanning beds or even sunless tanning by the use of certain creams which contain chemicals that cause darkening but uh, our ethnicities and Indians don't like to have a very tan skin and then I would say a prevention would work better than a treatment and if you know you're going outdoors or you're going on a vacation where you're going to be exposed to more ultraviolet rays outside it's better to prevent the tan by the use of a broad spectrum sunscreen with an SPF of minimum 30 with a PA of at least 3 plus which is water resistant so that it doesn't run off when you're sweating in a hot and humid environment so prevention is better the other treatments would be uh, removal of the tan and that could include some home remedies a word of caution here only do it after a test patch you could try out gram flour and uh, yogurt or uh, milk which has lactic acid in it uh, the treatments are mild, gentle exfoliation with a chemical exfoliant or doing a microdermabrasion. You could also ask your dermatologist for a skin lightening cream. And of course, don't forget, even as a treatment, the SPF is very important. Certain clinic procedures are also very important or can really help fade away that tan much more quickly. And they would include a microdermabrasion chemical peeling or a laser toning.